Hey say, baby, look how far you brought me. The journey that was tough. People said I couldn't do it. I myself didn't believe I could do it. But yeah, you came through for me. This is my graduation vlog. A testament that God is good. And God is faithful. And you will always come through. This is going to be a video of a roller coaster feelings. But in all, I say thank you. another vlog it's actually a very special vlog because it's my graduation vlog yes you heard it right your girl is graduating finally i'm done with college not done with school totally i'm done with college and today's tuesday and i'll be graduating next week tuesday so here i have my my whites that i'm going to be um shopping at the tailor's shop and then tomorrow i'll be going to buy my shoes and other necessary things that i need and you know throughout this vlog i'm going to be washing my hair yes i'm going to be unraveling these twists i'm going to be stretching my hair by the way i'm going to be doing my hair my natural hair myself and probably you're going to be seeing me going for my regalia and everything everything concerning the graduation is going to be in this vlog so please feel free to like share and subscribe and let's graduate hey guys welcome to the vlog so i dropped my white yesterday at the tailor i'm sorry i didn't film that part it was when i left the tailor shop that i remember oh i'm filming a vlog <laughs> however today is another day i am going to town now and i'm going to purchase my shoes and some necessary things like vest under things and all yeah and yeah so this is my fit for today i don't know if you guys can see but this is what I'm wearing, so cute. By the way guys, as I'm preparing for my graduation, my results are not even out yet, so I don't even know the division I'm coming out with, and I'm not even sure if the graduation is going to happen on Wednesday. But however, we walk by faith and not by sight. <laughs> so I'm just going to prepare everything in case of any, like, this video, we are going to be doing so, the voice over. So I came to I town, to please remind me guys, time, whenever I do please. go for shopping, either beats for my wedding, advise me not to take my We toured the whole town. I'm not, I'm not overemphasizing. We went to about four different shops, almost five shops, to look for shoes because she wanted me to wear something you know original but then they all looked like i'm going for a funeral literally so we came to this first shop um assuming that they started selling shoes but then we didn't get any shoes then we came to these other shoes the shoes were really original but guys this is my first degree and can you guys see the shoes like for me it felt like i'm an old lady so i was like mm, i'm not i was not feeling it at all like i was not even feeling it so i told her that the shoes i really like and so oh, you do this you are cheap and all of that we literally my feet were aching we went to the town and finally we got the shoes that i wanted and yeah so after the day for the shopping because my phone went off so i was unable to feel everything i went to the hospital um i had eye issues like five years ago but then they prescribed a lens for me but i don't like using lens so i stopped using it for over two years but then i came to the hospital again and my mom said i was going to give you a gift and she got me this glasses progressive i really like it so when you go under the sun it darkens and when you're off the sun it brightens again <laughs> Welcome back. Yes, I don't know if you guys can hear me. I'm actually outside on the street and I don't know if you guys can hear me. That is why I want to get myself a mic, but due to everything that is happening, I wanted to get a mic as a gift for myself as I'm graduating. But this whole thing is just like I'm really 
getting exhausted about it. So uh, final grades came out, like a, a, a past came out, and then my name was not there. So the thing that really pisses me off that two days before, three days before the list came out, I went to the university to check for my name, my grades and everything. And guys, the the administrator told me everything is okay, my grades are okay, my payments of fees are okay, and I'm okay. My name is okay. And then the list came out and I didn't see my name. Like, I'm so pissed. It's actually day two after the list came out. So, yeah, it's very embarrassing. People are looking at me right now. That's the, the irony of being a YouTuber. Anyway, so I'm going to the university where, like, I'm really pissed. This is not what I'm expecting to happen, but then... God has plans for me. So I'm going to go to the university. I really ask what the problem, <laughs> what the problem is. Uh, yeah, I just wanted to update you guys. Hi guys, welcome to the continuation of this vlog. <laughs> it has been probably four days after my vlog that i went to the clinic to get my lens because my eye has been affecting me a lot and I had to get my lens in between that that particular day that i came home my result came out and unfortunately my name was not among the list uh, actually this particular video was supposed to be my exciting graduation vlog getting ready getting my gown doing my pedicure doing my hair and then up to to graduation day but it's not going to it's not the way i expected it to be and these past few days has been the most worst days of my life because just imagine going through school for four bloody years studying your head out stressing sleepless night and then time for you to graduate you have these issues it's paining me a lot so the first um list came out and my name was not there and when i went to the administration to do some checkup that particular day i even wanted to film because it was so i went to the administration and they told me blah 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 and my name is not on the list i checked on my grades my grades are okay i check on my fees they're okay but then my list is not out and it has been worst days of my life i've been waking up crying I've been waking up scared. I've been feeling so overwhelmed. You know, after four years of studying, four years of sleepless nights, and other people are getting their gowns, other people are celebrating, posting, and all of that. It's just getting to my head. But anyways, um, yeah, so that is what has happened. And today is actually Monday, guys, and the graduation is like a day. I only have tomorrow. So I'm just going to get up, pick the bits that I have, and just, you know, I'm the only one that's going to encourage myself because everybody at home is like off key and everybody had that anticipation. Oh, you're graduating, you're graduating. And my mom is like, she's just down there and all of that. So anyways, um, I just pray everything works out today because I only have today. Yeah, today and tomorrow. But anyways. Okay, so I am going to the salon right now. I'm going to be doing my hair myself, but I don't have the strength to actually wash my hair and do anything. And it's a big day for me, so I just wanted to pamper myself. And today is actually my first day of going to the salon, so <laughs> come along with me as I go. So I'll be going to um, I Grow Organics, located at Eastern Street, an amazing salon you guys are going to see. And they do natural hair very beautifully they pamper your hair if you like you know when you take care of your hair and then you think there isn't somebody that can take care of your hair you can trust them they can definitely do the amazing job for you so after so this whole stack of my grades i'm just gonna like, pick up the bits and pieces so many things just, in between i went right, for my so gown and i couldn't get my gown on this particular day you know i just came to wash my hair and hoping i was going to get my gown but I was sitting there, I gave my sister my receipts to collect my gown. And she reached at the campus and told me, oh, your name is not there. And they were not going to give you any gown. I was so stressed up, guys. I was so stressed up. Like, I really wanted to film. You know, Sita really wanted to destroy this vlog. Like, wanted to destroy my graduation in general. But anyways, I came to Agro Organics to um, wash and blow dry my hair. Because... 
it was a very special day for me and i didn't have the time so yeah so um the other time the other day i went to scrub my foot because i don't do nails but i really wanted to pamper myself so i went to like do a foot scrub and the experience was amazing i'm so thankful the person that usually brush my scrub, scrub my foot or do my pedicure is it pedicure manicure whatever <laughs> Um, it was not available, so I had to check this other place. And on this particular day, I came for my gown. My mom took it to the dry cleaners. This was another bad day, guys. I came to dry cleaning and told me my coat wasn't ready because of the light saga and all that. I'm like, what are you saying? This is a whole laundry service, you know, office. You guys should have backup plan. So you can imagine, guys, I went there for at least. I went there at around the and I couldn't get my gown as well. So I had to wait. I waited for four bloody hours. But finally, the graduation day is here. Like, this vlog didn't actually come out the way I wanted it. Because you guys can imagine, during the ceremony, my phone was giving me full space. And you can imagine, I didn't have even up to 2,000 pictures. I had like 1,000 pictures on my gallery. But yeah, this was the graduation. These were the things I was able to gather. You know, just... Right. Hey, just, I just asked the for... Hi, daddy. Hi. thank god it was not easy but yeah so these were the people that were doing the culture that does this was where my phone went off but anyways thank you guys so much for watching this very short and crazy vlog Bye.